Jim Togo Noto, 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 Jim Togo Jim Togo Noto, 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 Subscribe, man. Show some love. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. But today we're doing something different. Today we talking about we're gonna talk about five things I wish I knew before I started my fitness journey. I feel like this will really help a lot of people who's trying to start their fitness journey in 2021, and for those who are already starting their fitness journey and need tips and advice. So stay tuned. Let's go. Jim, talk or notes. One we have is technique. All right. No, I feel like I wasn't big on technique when I started. But if you starting, make sure you get your technique right. Like you have to, or you just you just you just don't hurt yourself. To be honest, like make sure your squat position is right. Make sure when you bench in, like you put it in it. Like you just make sure your technique is right. If your technique and your form is wrong, you're gonna hurt yourself. You're gonna hurt yourself and then you're gonna be out for weeks and then you're gonna feel lazy and you don't wanna go back. So one number one is make sure your technique, your form is right. So don't rush when you're going through the gym. Like if you knew don't rush the process, you know, start with small weights, technique right, and then you move up weight. So make sure your technique is right. Alright? Number two is make sure you have your workout plan. Like plan your don't go to the gym and then say, Okay, I'm already here, I don't feel like doing leg, I'm gonna do upper body. Alright? That's my that's my biggest mistake I ever did. So right now my upper body is you know bigger, right? And my lower body is not up to up to the same level. Alright? Cause every day every time I go and I'm like, yo, I'm about to do I'm about to do legs and I'm like, nah, I don't feel like doing legs, I'm gonna do upper body. So Make sure you set your workout, all right? If you wanna get big, make sure you hit all the, all the, um, every part of your muscles. No, just write your workout down. Like, go, go on a, go on Google, um, upper body workout, leg workout. Okay, today I'ma do, um, all upper body. Tomorrow I'ma do lower body. So you get to, you know, give the same time, the same time and energy to a different part of the body. So make sure you set your workout so you don't go in the day, the day of the gym and say, you know what, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. No, you already have to plan on your phone or on your paper that, okay, today, Tuesday, I'm gonna do legs, Monday, I'm gonna do shoulders, whatever, whatever, whatever. So make sure you plan your workout, make sure you write down your workout so you know what you do when you go to the gym. All right, I'm gonna close. So another thing, number three, will be make sure you stretch, all right? Make sure you stretch before and after. You know, a lot of people don't want to stretch because they're already tired. They, they don't want to stretch at all because they're already tired from the gym and all. But you have to stretch, like before and after. You have to, or you just hurting yourself, all right? Make sure you stretch, man. I'm not, I, I don't know how, I could get that really, really into, but you gotta stretch or you're just gonna hurt yourself, all right? Make sure you stretch before and after, all right? Stretch, 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 all right? Number four will be pre-cooking meal. Like, just make sure, I, I usually don't do that. You know, I wait till I go home and then after the gym, I wait till I go home and then I don't have no food, so I'm gonna have to go buy McDonald's or some shit. You know, just make sure, especially if you're trying to lose weight, make sure you pre, you pre prep your meal. So you don't have to, you know, you don't have to go the cheap way, like go to McDonald's, go to Burger King and get some little snack. No, pre cook your meal so you have it. So as soon as you're done working out, you go home and eat. As soon as you wake up, you go home. You, as soon as you wake up, you eat what you have in your fridge, like what you already prep for, so you don't gotta look for an easy way, all right? Cause you get lazy. Like, let's say if you didn't, if you didn't prep your, your meal or nothing, right? You go from, you go to the gym. You go, let's say you go to work, right? You go straight to the gym. Now on your way, on your way 
to your house, you're thinking, damn, I don't got no food in the fridge. Damn, what should I eat? What am I going to eat? And then you walk in past McDonald's, you're going to say, you know what? I did good today. I'm going to hit McDonald's real quick. No. All right? Make sure you pre-cook you pre -cook your meal. You pre Not cook. You pre-prep your meal so you have it ready to glow. All right? So the last one I have will be don't overtrain yourself. All right? Your body need time to... Your body need days off to recover and grow, all right? If you keep going to the gym every day, every hour, every second, every minute, every second, you're not gonna see any growth, all right? You just hurting your body and your body's not gonna grow. So give yourself some time, like, like I used to be the person that go to the gym from Monday to Sunday and do the same shit, go, go to the gym twice, twice in a day, and I wasn't giving my body I wasn't giving my body time to heal, time to recover, time to, time to grow. So you need to do that. Make sure you let your body, you know, give, don't take two days, three days off. At least two days off, three days off to, to recover your body so your body is ready to go. The next day you're ready to go. So guys, this is the simple tips I have. If you want more tips, just let me know. Comments below, like, share, subscribe. Make sure you subscribe support the movement it's gym talk or no talk all right gym talk or no talk if you want to see more videos about tips just, just write in the comments like share and then let me know all right gym talk or no talk gym talk gym talk gym talk gym talk, gym talk.